Hello, and welcome back to Jeff Finnegan's Wake, the project where I, Jeff, read the book Finnegan's Wake to you for the last day, two pages at a time, one day at a time. We're on to page 126, which is the beginning of another chapter, question mark, I guess. I don't know. It's not like they're labeled or anything, but it looks like a chapter, so here we go. Page 126. So, who do you know tonight, lazy and gentlemen? The echo is where in the back of the woods call him forth. Sean Mac Irwick, brief dragger, for the concern of Messrs. Jan Yamanson and Song, rated 100 and thin per store hundred on this nightly quiz quick quack of the twelve apostrophes set by Jocket Mac Irwick. He misunderstruck and aimed for Am Allo of number three of them, and left his free natural reposts to four of them in their own fine artful disorder. One, what second to none, Mither reactor and Maximos bridges maker was the first to rise taller through his bean's tail than the blue gum Buoboa Babuan, or the gigantus Wellingtonia Sequoia, went nudaboots with trouters into a life lifiette when she was barely in her tricklies, was well known to Claude a consultation, a conciliation cap onto the esker of the, his hooth, sports a chain ganger's Albert solemnly over his Hollander's epulence, though he weighed a new ton when there felled his lurst first lap apple, give the heinousness of choice to every night betwixt yesterdicks and two Marys, had seven all successive colored saran saraban maids on the same big white drawing room hearth rug, is a will be forced to this hour at house as he was in Heather, pumped his, the Catholic war tree and shocked the Protestung Boyne killed his own hungry self in anger as a young man, found fodder for five when Almark and Rose go flooded with hearish tutors, Cornish made easy, voucher. Alright, page 126 of Finnegan's Wake on the ongoing series Jeff Finnegan's Wake. I uh, bid you adieu and good night and good night. Good night. Good, good night.